Well, it's official. I've mastered the art of procrastination in my own awful tube channel. What is the key to good writing? I've been trying to figure it out for 20 years. I've tried to learn everything I can about writing. All the books, I did a university course. I've tried to figure it out. And yet, I couldn't tell you how to do it. The whole thing is a mystery to me. I've written novellas, novels, short stories, a screenplay, a radio play, lyrics, poems, articles, flash fiction. I've written a letter to the CEO of the company I work for calling him delusional, which was almost certainly a mistake. I've written shopping lists, to-do lists, podcast scripts, comedy sketches, fiction, non-fiction. I've written comedy, horror, experimental, weird fiction, far-fetched fiction, surreal stuff, comedy sci-fi drama i've written my name on a wall with paint i've written postcards tweets facebook posts instagram rants kids books book reviews comic book scripts character profiles synopses query letters pictures youtube scripts i've written in the snow with my own pee if you can write it i have written it you hear that alarm it's gone. Somebody stole my car. But if I were to give you advice on writing, I wouldn't know where to start. All of the ideas on story structure, on grammar, on voice, on the style. Right now it all exists as loosely connected ideas floating around my mind like fireflies in a fog. I've never tried to lay out in a neat row and actually try and understand what it is I'm doing when I'm putting pen to paper or finger to plastic. I will, going forwards with this channel, channel, this channel, words, they can be your enemy. I will, going forwards with this channel, try and put some of my thoughts into a coherent set of tips. Maybe. Or waffle. That makes sense. Yes. That is what I will try and do. Not yet. That will take time. And we'll take fort! I will start here with this strange video of instruction. And I'll concern myself with future videos when future videos happen. It's gonna be a weird ride. I hope you decide to subscribe to the channel and come along with me. Let's take this journey together and see if we can't tie this thing down. Figure out what's important and what's not. What ticks to kick and which ones to polish. I have much to write. Deadlines loom. I'm 52 pages into a screenplay which is meant to be finished by the end of this month. I have a novella I haven't finished that was due at the end of last month. And I'm meant to be starting a new full length novel in the beginning of next month. And what am I doing? Spinning around on my swivel chair, talking to you. The question is, why am I doing this? Let's cut to me in full color yesterday morning. Hello, so it's my birthday today. And ever since I was a little kid, I dreamed of making movies. And I used to make really crap films with all my friends. What I really wanted is something that I got today. My own fucking TV studio. <laughs> I got... Got my rig. Look, there's us on the green screen. See, there's Rachel. Uh, I've got this cool... This is a H5 Zoom microphone, pop shield. This is for recording audiobooks, which I also have that. We've got studio lights. In fact, we've got loads of them because they sent us the wrong shit and we've got loads of whatever we're supposed to get. <laughs> yes, yesterday was my birthday and yes, I live in a tent. What does one do when they receive a green screen as a birthday gift? Well, they start a YouTube channel and make videos. I named mine OrthoTube thinking it was amazing that there are authors making videos on YouTube and none of them thought to call their channel OrthoTube. So I called my channel OrthoTube and then I discovered that the collective noun for authors to make YouTube videos is OrthoTube. That is their corner of YouTube where the authors are. It's called OrthoTube. And 
I have named my channel WarforTube. I feel like I have appropriated the name of a community and I didn't mean to do that and I'm sorry. The official name for this channel is WarforTube with Andrew Chapman. That's me. So, sorry if I've caused any offence by stealing the name WarforTube and calling my channel WarforTube and saying it over and over again and now when anybody searches WarforTube my videos or my channel might be them. People might think, oh, this is Orphitube. This isn't Orphitube. This is a channel called Orphitube, but it is not in itself Orphitube. Okay. I mean, I think it's unlikely this video will get more than six views anyway. I mean, the first channel on any YouTube channel doesn't really go anywhere. You know, nobody sees it. You have to build a following. You have to get people to like you and watch your videos and then. Maybe the, no, I mean, who goes back to watch the first video of the person of a new YouTube channel? Nobody's going to see this. Anyway, I have my laptop sat open next to me with my whip, my work in progress, open, waiting for me to add words to it. Uh, I'm not happy with the last scene I wrote. Uh, I'm not happy with the last scene I wrote of the screenplay. And a part of me knows that that's okay, just plow on, get the first draft of the screenplay done and worry about fixing the scene in the second draft or in the rewrite. But I can't move on. I can't. The scene is garbage and it needs to be rewritten. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do that. I'm going to stop doing this and I'm going to do that. I'm going to go and write like I'm supposed to be doing. Not mucking about on youtube thanks for watching if you're watching this as a writer get off youtube get back to work you're meant to be writing this is procrastination and you know it if you're a reader hello i forgot how attractive you are i have links to my books below the video subscribe like share on social media stay indoors run around the house dancing eat bad food drink good wine and be whatever you want to be